emigrant versus immigrant. These two words are not similar in meaning. As a matter of fact, they are opposite in meaning. And if you don't understand the difference between each of them, then you are likely to have been using them to mean the same thing. Now, who is an emigrant? An emigrant is someone who leaves their home country to live in another country. Who is an immigrant? An immigrant is someone who comes to live in a country that is not their native home. Now, the difference between them lies in perspective. For instance, if you were a South African and you want to relocate to America, now from the perspective of the South Africans around you, you are regarded as an immigrant because you are about to leave South Africa. Now, by the time you get to America, from the perspective of the Americans, you are regarded as an immigrant because you have just come into their country. So the difference lies in perspective. Now let us take a look at this sentence and see how emigrants and immigrants are being used. After becoming an emigrant from Sweden, Eric quickly adapted to his new life as an immigrant in Australia. In this sentence, Eric is a Swedish and is about to leave Sweden for Australia. Now, his fellow Swedish can call him an emigrant because he's about to leave Sweden. And by the time he arrives in Australia, the Australians can call him an immigrant because he has just arrived in Australia. Now, in summary, if an individual who is a citizen of your country is about to leave your country to settle in another country, that individual to you is an emigrant. But if an individual who is not a citizen of your country is coming into your country to settle in it, to you, that individual is an immigrant. I hope by now you understand the difference between these words so that next time when you are going to use them, you use them correctly. Thank you very much for watching. Please, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and share. And if you haven't subscribed already, please support my channel by subscribing.